Welcome back. Filmgate Interactive is South Florida's only transmedia conference. What does that mean and why do you need to check it out? Well, here's Diliana Alexander. Diliana, thank you so much for coming on the show. How are you? Thank you for having me and I appreciate your time. It's always good to meet a fellow movie, TV lover, fan, you know, someone in the industry. It's very cool. So, Absolutely. So, uh, so I'm excited. So Filmgate Interactive, is it's starting its third year. Mm -hmm. Tell us about it. Well, it started with our belief, we all filmmakers, actually our whole collective is independent filmmakers and producers and animators, but we, it started with our belief that the future of entertainment is immersive and interactive. Um, so what we wanted to do is um, showcase interactive and immersive projects, and that spans from transmedia, opera, to interactive screenings, and everything else in between. Um, but also we wanted to create this collaborative sandboxes for international and local producers and filmmakers to meet, collaborate, create, and hopefully start making interactive projects in South Florida. Uh, other than, than Filmgate, does this type of festival, uh, does it exist down here in South Florida? Um, no, we're the only ones yeah. in South Florida. Um, so some of the biggest festivals have now um, a component. So Tribeca does, um, Sundance has a new Frontier Lab, Berlin, um, Toronto, um, but we're the only festival that concentrate, concentrates solely on the interactive and immersive. We don't do anything else. Uh, what is the industry like down here? You know, I, I've thought for many years that I've always been surprised that there wasn't more film and there wasn't more TV right. down here just because of the weather and the scenery. Right. Uh, what, you're in the sort of nooks and crannies of it. What do you think? Yeah. Um, well, we all know how great Miami Vice was for Florida, not just for um, you know for having this um, very well paid film industry that uh, that trickles down to the different uh, economies being hotels or massages or restaurants um, but it's always it was also great for tourism so many people come to Florida just because they saw Miami Vice and I think you know Florida and Miami is amazing um, unfortunately for the last two years we haven't had any incentives in South Florida so that has drained a lot of the projects that should have been made here to different um, areas, regions like Atlanta or um, New Orleans or even back to New York where um, the incentives are so great. Um, so a lot of our talent is actually exiting from South Florida and going to these different places. There are some amazing people, um, film commissioners um, of Miami-Dade and also Broward and, and of, of, of Miami Beach that are fighting for the incentives to come back. There's Film Florida that also is also doing that. We don't do this. Yep. What we do is we try to support independent filmmakers here to make their films and hopefully not leave. So for example, one of our um, one of our members last year, his feature film just got into Sundance, his name is Kenny Richards. He made it here, uh, uh, completely self-funded, no incentives, um, probably on zero to no, no budget. And you know, he got into Sundance, so that's amazing. So you don't really need to leave anymore. You don't go to, uh, need to go to LA, New York to, um, make your film sure. with, with the advances of technology. Uh, the next Steven Spielberg could be in Cooper City, for all we know. We hope so. <laughs> we'll, we will support them. Good. Uh, <laughs> all right. So what, what kind of audience do you typically um, get for Filmgate? So most of our audience is um, professionals, film, filmmakers, or amateurs that are f film loving and creating that sphere of photography and film and interactive and gaming. Um, we have a lot of production companies that come. Um, also, uh, anyone, um, uh, resellers, um, rental companies, um, students as well uh, from mostly film schools, um, coders, uh, gamers, uh, architects, you name it. Right. Um, but we also, what we noticed is that immediately we became international. People came for our first festival, people flew in from Australia and drove from Portland. It was, it was surprising that so quickly we became an international festival. The cool thing about South Florida is that the region extends beyond South Florida. It goes to the Caribbean and South America and Central America and the surrounding states. So um, in that respect, we represent a very extended and very interesting, re interesting region. But anybody can can go, right? Yes, yeah. it's free and open to the public. Yeah, most of most of it is free and open to the public. <laughs> right. But the passes are sixty dollars for students and a hundred for yeah. regular, and that includes everything in the festival. Is there anything extra special this year that people are going to be blown away by? Right. Um, so for the first 
year we are adding a high school component. Uh, we are, uh, there's a lab called Learn Do Share that's coming down here for the first time ever in Miami. It's led by Lance Weiler, who is quite known in the transmedia interactive circles. Um, he is leading the lab with his partner, Magalis Martinez, and uh, we are limiting it to high school students. And what they're going to do is they're going to be mentored by MIT professors and Columbia professors, uh, as well as the city and officials from Miami, Dade and Miami, and hopefully Broward, because Broward students are coming as well. Um, and they will tackle a specific South Florida problem, so maybe rising waters or transportation. And they will come up with prototypes on how to solve this. So it has a very big social component. And then we'll get for the winning project, we'll give um, $1,000 for them to continue prototyping this and hopefully present some uh, scalable solution during film gate next but, year. But uh, presented as a film or as a video project? It could be anything. Yeah. It could be it could be a bus that's powered by sun. It doesn't have to be. So what, what we're doing is we're inviting filmmakers, coders, um, base, uh, students that come from different ethnic backgrounds, from different maybe underserved communities. So it's not just the ones that have the money that have been supporting these programs, but also um, kids that are coming from, from places where they maybe didn't have that kind of opportunity. And they'll all be intermixing and, and brainstorming. What is the Ace Ventura Pet Detective Miami oh, that Beach? One. That sounds so cool. Doesn't it sound awesome? Yes. Yeah, I love, I love it. What too. is the deal? Um, so, so Ace Ventura Pet Detective, um, the ultimate Miami movie, yeah. right? I heard that every person that gets hired by the Miami Dolphins has to watch Ace Ventura when they get hired before they start working. So it is something that's so um, lo beloved in the community. Um, so what we're doing is we are basically recreating the experience where all of the audience members become a part of the movie. Um, it's going to happen at the Bass Museum. Um, there will be a free and open to the public component and also a ticketed component inside. Um, a mascot will get stolen, and that's all I can tell about okay. what ex I want. But it, all, I, I should mention that the Dolphins will be involved. Um, I'm not going to say in what capacity. We are in negotiations with Tone Loke to come and perform. So. And so the people who go, or maybe you can't say this, maybe this is a surprise, yeah. they'll act out scene dialogue from the film? There will be certain scenes, there will be immersive sets from the film, there will be things that are inspired by the film, then we might even set a Guinness record. Wow. Does someone get to say laces out, Finkel? Yes. Of course. I mean, that's the line from the movie. Yeah. You I get want to say, say that. laces out, yeah. Finkel. Yeah. All right. So give us the particulars, the when, the where, how to get tickets. Give us all the good stuff. Sure. Um, so Filmgate runs from February 1st till February 8th in Miami Beach and Miami. Um, and uh, you can go to film-gate.org to find out the event schedule look at the interactive map, and also buy tickets or passes. Sounds great, and I really do want to be in the Ace Ventura, uh, the, the recreation, yeah. We're gonna, you're going to be in it. So cool. <laughs> I have to start doing my, my Jim Carrey stuff. We will you send know? you a character description <laughs> soon. <laughs> Please do. So good to see you, and enjoy the festival, and so we'll nice see you there. So nice to meet you. Thank All you right. so much for your time. You got it.